Look at his time. He's scrambling. Kenny Crumpton. Are you ready for this, Kenny? We, we are ready to watch. Yeah, I'm ready to hurt. <laughs> <laughs> well, you're a brave man. You really are. You're yeah. brave. Yeah, well, so brave. Uh, brave, crazy, whatever. Yeah, the, the light, it's all gray matter, brother. Brave, brave crazy. Provides great all entertainment. Right, we're here. <laughs> there you go. It's, it's fun to watch. <laughs> Sky Aerial Studios right here in the heart of downtown Cleveland. I'm hanging out with Emily, and we're talking about these are great exercises that are a little bit different than your traditional exercise. So we're going to we're gonna show like an advanced move and a beginning move because yep. we don't want to intimidate people. So obviously this is not a beginning move, what we're seeing. Oh, really no. Right. And these are called silks or, or the hammocks. Hammocks. Yep. Like, Okay, so talk to us about what Britt's doing. Oh so gosh. Brittany's going into a cross back straddle. It's of very she is. ab heavy, very <laughs> hard. <laughs> so lots of, a lot of ab work you're saying? Okay. Oh yeah, you'll you feel that the heavy. next day. Gotcha. And then she's gonna transition into a standing pose. Now this is something she would teach in our um, like intermediate to advanced classes. Gotcha. But it doesn't start that way. I, Brittany showed me a move, so you're gonna talk me through this. Okay, we're gonna talk about a beginner move, all right? So I'm putting my hands down by my side. Yeah. This at the right at the small of my <laughs> back. I walk out slowly, put my hands up, and then come back, put my feet. Oh, that feels so much better. That's perfect. Aha! There it is, folks. Okay, a little help. I'm stuck. <laughs> so that's the beginning move. So that's what you guys would teach. In the beginning class, correct? Yeah. All right, let's come over here and the liras. Now these are interesting because they're like hanging hula hoops. <laughs> okay, so let's talk about a beginning. Oh well, advanced move. Advanced move first. Jen. Okay, Jen. She is our um, lira instructor, and this is something you can expect to see in an intermediate lira class. Wow. Muscle and she's not only utilizing the hoop, but the span set as well. <laughs> My goodness, that is just crazy. Okay, beginning move here which what we would learn in the beginning class yep okay what are we seeing here we are going up into a top bar knee hang it's actually very easy to do but really? looks intimidating okay. yeah. i was about to say that's an easy, <laughs> <It's> easy. move <laughs> <laughs> and then she can slide down into her back into what we call a rest pose doesn't require a lot of muscle okay because <laughs> she's using the lira as support there yes awesome Okay, and then behind her, we have some random stuff. So let's talk about this. So age groups, you know, what is too young? What's too old to start when we talk about uh, sky aerial exercises and all these different types of exercises? So we even teach um, preschool classes here. So we teach age three all the way up to 100 or higher. Okay, just depending <laughs> on the person's yeah, physical ability. Absolutely. And you, we really wouldn't, I wanted to show the beginning moves because that's how, because people might look like, there's no way I can do that. Well, you work to that point. Right? Yeah, you absolutely. Yeah, anybody could do it. Okay, excellent. And then over here, we're seeing our. Um, this is our flow class. Let's yeah. talk about flow. So if aerial is not your thing, we offer um, lots of opportunities where you can work circus acts from the ground. Um, this is one of them. We do staff. We have hula hoops, sear wheels. Okay. And Sophia here teaches those classes. Excellent. All right. So we're looking at silks, and then over here on the um, on this bar, that's another interesting. <laughs> exercise. Let's talk about what did you call it? The flying pole. Flying pole. Thank you. Flying pole exercises. Again, another amazing use of your own body. To oh yeah. Because I'm looking at upper body here. Um, he did some ab when he was coming over, right? Oh, absolutely. That one is very intimidating. <laughs> now, how do you choose what people start on, or is it their kind of? Oh, I always wanted to learn how to do this. How do we? How do you figure that out in the beginning? So we always recommend that um, students start on a lira or hammocks. Okay. And typically people have a preference. So these liras are steel. Okay. So they hurt. Okay. Um, but you very, people prefer if they'd rather tie silks around them okay. or manipulate their body around an apparatus. Because we're looking at the silks now and these are without the hammock because the yes. silks are, they're not connected at the end. Correct. Awesome. Okay. Um, so each class is about an hour long. Yep, we do a 15 minute warm up and then 45 minutes on our apparatuses. Okay, we're gonna put a link to your website so people can learn everything they wanna learn about the Sky Aerial Studios. How awesome, I did my move, I'm okay. <laughs> I guess I'll go, thank you very much. I guess I'll come to my, my Lyra move, which scares me, but I'm gonna try the Lyra. All right, we're gonna go back to you guys in the studio. How about that? I'm still here, one piece, and no wardrobe malfunctions. That's very important. <laughs>